my name is Patrick from Meko Congrate. Today we are at uh, Ngong trying to take the measurement of the project and uh, we have seen the client has reached the uh, ring beam level for the crown floor. Uh, for to get the accurate measurement, uh, we normally tell uh, advise the clients that uh, taking the measurement should be at the ring beam level. Like you can see at that particular at this point, he has done the ring beam. So on the other side, he hasn't done the ring beam. So it is advisable for the client to do the ring beam for us to do the measurement. Because if you do the measurement once the structure is not yet in the ring beam level, there is a tendency or there's a chance of you getting uh, some few millimeters less once the ring beam has been done. Basically, in terms of a measurement, is the normal the normal equipment we use the the measuring tape. The five, this is 7.5 meter tape, and then we have the long uh, tape. And uh, the second thing is the safety measure, safety issue. We are you need to have a helmet, a reflector. In terms of methodology, that is now with the procedure of uh, taking the measurement. First of all, you take the measurement inside to inside. After that, you have to take the overall length, the overall length of the building and overall uh, dimension of the building. Okay. So that you can have a clear picture and the proper measurements for you to produce the beams according to the, the structure of the client. Tell me more about the thickness of the wall. Does it matter? Yes, it matters because uh, for us to to know the length of the beam, whereby the beam is going to sit on, you have to know if it is 200 millimeter, if it is not sufficient enough, you advise the client to add, to add the thickness of the ring beam. Okay, in terms of uh, once we, we are on site, we ensure that the ring beam is fairly level so that the, the, our beams will be lying on a fairly flat surface, failure to which uh, the beams won't be level and then uh, it will the, cl the client will be putting more uh, screed on top of it because the ring beam had a problem. But to avoid that is to ensure that the ring beam is fairly leveled. Like, uh, like uh, this uh, side specifically, the, the ring beams are, are fairly leveled. So this uh, could, the contractor has done a good job. Sometimes uh, the client has produced the drawings and uh, or he has uh, sketched maybe he never had uh, the proper drawings so you request the, the client to give you the drawings you print and uh, the sketch you had initially so that before you come to site you know what you are going to do the, the kind of a structure you are going to measure the reporting part now is not for the client it is for the the records purposes for future reference in case of there is, an, if there is any problems we can uh, track uh, who did the measurement and then we, how we are, are we going to solve the problem? Who is the client? How did you, how did you go to the site? Location, things like that. So that uh, in case, let's say the beams are uh, are less or though it is in rare cases whereby we have uh, beams which are less, in case there is any problem, we can track uh, the records who did this and then we know how we are going to solve the problems.